I'd like to talk about today. I'll try and be quick so we can get to the fun stuff. Um, I would first like to thank the First United Congregational Church for the use of their facility, Emery, our fantastic sound man, and the use of their podcast system that will record all the performances today, so you guys will be able to see them for your friends and family. Um, probably by Monday or Tuesday, I'll email the link out to everyone. Um, I want to thank Jeremy Peterman, our trumpeter. job. Um, he's really been great at making all of our singers feel really confident and all of those mainly singing teachers not have to worry about playing the piano, so we really like that. Um, um, I would also like to welcome Annalisa and Sarah's private studio students here today. Um, we're really excited and happy that they're here and happy that they add lots of young talent to our studio performances today. So thank you, Annalisa. important things. Uh, the bathrooms are across the courtyard to the left. Please, um, performers, if you need to go, go now, because I don't want people getting up during your performance, okay? Um, adults, it's obviously at your discretion. <laughs> uh, um, also, we will be offering uh, violin lessons in January at our Awatuki studio, so that's going to be on Wednesday, ev Wednesday evenings and Saturday mornings, so I'm really excited about that. Also, if you have a cell phone on, please turn it off or put it on silent if you've forgotten to do so, so they don't so it doesn't disturb any performances. I'm just going to talk a little bit about my evolution in this studio, so you guys know where I'm coming from and where I'm going. Um, RLS Studios has been involved in changing young people's lives for the past 10 years. Most of my students past are now professionals living in LA and New York City, pursuing musical careers or in college programs such as Tisch and NYU University. Occasionally when they're in town, they still come to visit me, telling me about their young, exciting lives. Just recently, one of my students named Jasmine um, was in the Macy's Day Parade float. She's called an American bombshell. They travel around the country as singing and dancing. And um, I have other students, and Annalisa has lots of students that are in colleges all over the, all over the country in vocal performance training. Um, in 2007, I came to Phoenix. I closed my studio in Florida, and I opened my studio in home and inside of Dance Studio 111, thanks to the Basham family and Kimberly Lewis, the owner of Dance Studio 111. We've been open almost four years, and I've seen amazing growth and development from all of the students. I am blessed to have mentors such as Gail dubenbaum Massaro, the director of the Phoenix Opera, and Janet Ehrlich, the director of the Fort Lauderdale Children's Theater, who allow me to continue to grow as a teacher, a mentor, and a business owner. My faculty is no less than amazing. Mr. J.J. Bautista, manager and musician. <laughs> Miss Annalisa Hackett, opera diva and pianist. <laughs> Miss Sarah Costa, vocal star and fitness enthusiast. <laughs> and Miss Catherine Mor Morris, who isn't here with us, but she is a vocal pedagogue enthusiast, a singer, and a great motivator. They are all so talented and give each student what they need. They are collaborative and self-motivated, and that is the mirror image I seek in our student body. I have now opened another studio inside the number three children's theater in the country, and some amazing young talent is there as well. Um, that is why I've decided to open a new wing of my business that is a little more cumulative. Arla Studios is now opening a new, a new part of the business in the spring, a college and career consultation business with a focus on students looking to pursue a commercial career in the arts or classical career. This service will consult the following areas of development, where to go to college, what to play or sing, how to audition, scholarship information, pre-college programs and competitions, in-studio demo recordings, acting and dance consults, talent management, resume building, musical training and theory, and overall student competency in his or her field. I believe um, from all the years that I've been teaching is that you can't look at a young person and say, oh, well, they're just a little kid, or they're, they're just a little singer, or they're just a little piano player. I treat everyone like they're young adults. And with that, I see the development from a student from here all the way to here. Whether it ends up being that they want to be a famous singer, or a pianist, or a guitar player, or on stage, or with a band, or whatever, it doesn't matter. Whatever it 
that's why you know, making a difference in their lives when they're young and treating them like little adults helps them to um, move, move down that path. Um, I'm excited about this evolution and I look forward to the continued growth and development of not only students but my faculty as well. If you believe your child is My name is Marianne Friedberg, and I'm nine years old. My name is Marissa Friedberg, and I'm nine years old. And my name is Magdalena Friedberg, and I'm nine years old. And, and we're, we're going to sing Christmas Don't, Don't Be Late. Christmas, Christmas time is near. Time for toys and time for cheer. We been good. I just want to say I forgot this wonderful little child here, and her name is Hunter, and we all love her very much, and I'm very sorry that I forgot her. So you want to say your name first, thank you, and then I'm going to give you this other mic, okay? Hello, my name is Hunter, I'm eight years old, and I'm going to be singing These Are a Few of My Favorite Things. Raindrops on roses and whiskers on kittens, bright copper kettles and warm woolen mittens, brown paper packages tied up with strings. These are a few of my favorite things. Cream colored ponies and crisp apple strudels, doorbells and sleigh bells and schnitzels with noodles, while geese that fly with the moon on their wings. These are a few of my favorite things. Girls in white dresses with blue satin sashes. Snowflakes that stay on my nose and eyelashes. Silver white winters that melt into spring. These are a few of my favorite things. When the dog bites, when the bee when I'm feeling sad I simply remember my favorite things And then I don't feel so bad
The sun will come out tomorrow. Bet your bottom dollar that tomorrow there'll be sun. Just thinking about tomorrow clears away the cobwebs and the sorrow till there's none. When I'm stuck with a day that's gray and lonely, I just stick out my chin and grin and say, oh, the, oh, the sun will come out tomorrow. So you got to hang on till tomorrow. Come what may, tomorrow, tomorrow, I love you tomorrow. You're always a day. Freebird, I am 10 years old. I'll be singing Lady.
My name is Lillian List, I am eight years old, and I am going to play Over the River and Through the Woods on the piano. Hi, my name is Tia. I'm six, and I'm going to be singing the 
Lizzie Cleaver, I am 13 years old and I will be singing Death of Heaven. chosen me now to carry your son I am waiting in a silent prayer I am frightened by the Do you wonder as you watch my face if another one should have had my place? But I offer all I 
I'm May Sangren. I'm 12 years old, and I'm going to be playing I Saw Mommy Kissing Santa Claus. Woohoo! <laughs> I'd like a little applause here. Come on, like, uh, thank you. <laughs> Raindrops on roses and whiskers on kittens Bright copper kettles and warm woolen mittens Brown paper packages tied up with strings These are a few of my favorite things Green Cream-colored ponies and crisp apple strudels, doorbells and sleigh bells and snitchels with noodles, wild geese that fly with the moon on their wings. These are a few of my favorite things. Girls in white dresses with blue satin sashes, snowflakes that stay on my nose and eyelashes, silver white winters that melt into springs. These are a few of my favorite things. When the dog bites, when the bee stings, when I'm feeling sad, I simply remember my favorite things And then I don't feel so bad Hunter, you're up next. Thank you. 
Jacqueline Bliss is next. The weather outside is frightful, but the fire is so delightful. And since we've no place to go, let it snow, let it snow, let it snow. It doesn't show signs of stopping, and I brought some corn for popping. The lights are turned way down low, let it snow, let it snow. Snow. When we finally kiss goodnight, how will he going out in the storm? But if you really hold me tight, all the way home I'll be warm. The fire is slowly dying, and my dear, we're still goodbying. But as long as you love me so, let it snow. Snow, let it snow. When we finally kiss goodnight, how will he going out in the storm? But if you really hold me tight, all the way home I'll be warm. The fire is slowly dying, and my dear, we're still goodbying. But as long as you love me so. Let it snow, let it snow, let it snow. Let it snow, let it snow, let it snow. Let it snow, let it snow, let it snow. Stephanie Larson's going to be next. This is my street. I smile at the faces I've known all my life. They regard me with pride, and everyone's sweet. They say you're going places. So, how can I say that while I was away? I had so much to hide. Hey, guys, it's me. The biggest disappointment, you know. The kid couldn't hack it. She's back. And she's walking real slow. Welcome home, just breathe. Just breathe. As the radio plays old forgotten boleros, I think of the days when the city was mine. I remember the praise, I te oro, te quiero. The neighborhood waved and said, Nina, be brave and you're gonna be fine. And maybe it's me, but it all seems like a lifetime to go. So what do I say to these faces that I used to know? Hey, I'm home. I am the one who made it out, the one who always made the grade. 
But maybe I should have just stayed home When I was a child I stayed wide awake Climbed to the highest place on every fire escape Restless to climb I got every scholarship, saved every dollar The first to go to college How do I tell them why I'm coming back home With my eyes on the horizon Just me and the GWB Asking Jeanina, what'll you be? Straighten the spine, smile for the neighbors. Everything's fine, everything's cool. The standard reply, lots of tests, lots of papers. Smile, wave goodbye, and pray to the sky. Oh God, and what will my parents say? Can I go in there and say, I know that I'm letting you down. Just Healer. I'm 10 years old and I'm going to be singing It's the Most Wonderful Time of the Year. It's the most wonderful time of the year With the kids jingle belling and everyone telling you be of good cheer It's the most wonderful time of the year It's the half happiest season of all with those holiday greetings and gay happy meetings when friends come to call. It's the hap happiest season of all. There'll be parties for hosting, marshmallows for toasting, and caroling out in the snow. There'll be scary ghost stories and tales of the glories of Christmas is long, long ago. It's the most wonderful time of the year. 
There'll be much mistletoeing and hearts will be glowing when loved ones are near. It's the most wonderful time of the Daviana. Benjamin, I'm 11 years old and I'll be playing Stay at Night on the guitar.
Casey Hemp. I'm 12 years old, and I'll be singing the Christmas song. Chestnuts roasting on an open fire. Jack Frost nipping at your nose. Yuletide carols being sung by a choir and folks dressed up like Eskimos. Everybody knows. A turkey and some mistletoe Help to make the season bright Tiny tots with their eyes all aglow Will find it hard to sleep tonight They know that say He's loaded lots of toys and goodies on his sleigh. And every mother's child is gonna spy to see if reindeer really know how to fly. And so I'm offering a simple phrase to kids from one Although it's been said many times, many ways, Merry Christmas to you. They know that Santa's on his way. He's loaded lots of toys and goodies on his sleigh. So it's been said many times, many ways. Merry Christmas, Merry Christmas, Merry Christmas to you. around the Christmas tree on the piano.
Katie Lund, I'm 15, and I'm going to be playing the Arabian dance from Tchaikovsky's Nutcracker. Well, I have about how when I say, say red, for example, there's no way of knowing if red means the same thing in your head as red means in my head when someone says red, and how if we are traveling at almost the speed of light, and we're holding a light, that light would still travel away from us at the full speed of light, which seems right in a way, what I'm trying to say, I'm not sure. But I wonder if inside my head I'm not just a bit different from some of my friends These answers that come into my mind unbidden These stories delivered to me fully written And when everyone shouts, they seem to like shouting The noise in my head is incredibly loud And I wish they'd just stop my dad and my mom and the telly and the stories would stop for just once and I'm sorry but I'm not quite explaining it right but this noise becomes anger and the anger is light and this burning inside me would usually fade 
Just a nice kind of quiet Like the sound of a page being turned in a book Or a pause for a walk in the woods Quiet Like silence but not really Silent, just a nice kind of quiet, like the sound when you lie upside down in your bed, just the sound of your heart in your head, and though the people around me. Their mouths are still moving The words they are for me Cannot reach me anymore And it is quiet And I am warm Like I've said My name is Nicholas Morrow. I am nine years old, and I'm going to be playing Echoes, an original composition by me. Thank you. 
Sydney, you're going to be up. Oh, okay. My name is Sydney Schmidt. I'm 13 years old, and I will be playing Sonatina in C, First Movement by Clementi.
can we have everybody stand up that performed and take a nice big bow? <laughs> what a talented group of young performers. Um, amazing, thanks parents for all your support and supporting your children in the arts. Um, and now the best part of the show, the milk and cookies. <laughs> 